let's get it settled down. I don't down. think you're cut out for this. <laughs> I really don't think so either. All right. No, you're doing fine. You're doing fine. So yeah, more head. Yeah, not quite that steep. Not quite that. Not that quite steep. My controls. My controls. controls. My controls. All right. I was like, like, I know that's Lou Dix. What's wrong? With that? <laughs> I know. That's the thing. My reputation is going down the. Ah. All right, boys and girls, welcome to the wheelhouse of Cessna 781 Bravo Golf. I'm in the left seat today because somebody's coming on the channel that you've never seen before. I've only flown with him once. I've done one ground session with him, but uh, we've got a check ride that's coming up very, very soon. How can you get through his training that quickly, you ask? Well, he's already a CFI and he's going for his CF double I, which in all honesty, once you're a CFI, it's a pretty easy and straightforward add-on. Uh, the particular examiner that we're going with uh, likes to take the controls and act like a student, which I've actually done before with a CFI candidate. This. Go around. So we deliberate. Not that far. Not that far. Keep that. Keep that. Keep that coordination. Oh, what, uh, what, do I, what do I do? <laughs> keep, keep that. Your controls. Oh, shit. shit. <laughs> so. We're gonna go up and I'm gonna play the student a little bit on an ILS approach into Samford International. I actually don't know what I'm gonna throw at him. I don't know how I can mess up a, an ILS. I'm gonna set up the cameras, wait for Ryan, and uh, then off we go. Go on, Nick. If you want the privilege of flying with us, be quicker. That's going, that's going, that's got a beautiful nick on it. Alright, it's uh, my controls. Alright, your controls. Head down, close your eyes, please. Right, okay. 3, oh yeah, that's going to be a good one. Uh, heading south. Third Recover! Steep turn, that's it, traffic. Alright, so we're... We have our nose high, so we push the nose down, got the full power in. Which we're accelerating now, so we'll pull back to normal. We're doing some kind of mischief over here. <laughs> I don't know if the unusual attitude caused that. <laughs> My controls. Your controls. Head down, close your eyes. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Keep those eyes closed. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Are we doing spin training today or what? <laughs> oh, this is gonna be really nasty. Recover. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, the goal there, we are nose down, power comes out, we level the wings first, then pull to the horizon. That's what we're looking for there. Cool. Alright, now let me figure out if you have messed with my S, <laughs> S boss. I bet that's what changed. Ah! We got it, we got it, we got it. Son of a bitch. Alright, we can, we can leave it like that. No, no, you can turn it back on you. Okay. Let's do the Arn of Leesburg and then yeah. ILS Sanford. Yep, that's gotta, all. You probably gotta check to make sure you didn't delete any yeah, uh, my field, points out of your uh, database. My fields are there. He's like, delete, somehow figured out how to delete an approach. <laughs> all right. On the phone with Garmin. Keep your eyes closed. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Let me try. What do you figure we're on an Orlando approach here? 1977 right now? November 71, Bravo Golf, radar contact 10 miles north of Disney World, indicating 2,500, altimeter 3003, say your type aircraft and request. All right, 3003, uh, we are a Skyhawk, uh, Cessna 172, we'd like to pick up an RNAV uh, circle, circling approach into Leesburg, and uh, we have a couple more approaches after that, or I can give them to you an hour later. I'll just do the RNAV circle now, I'll, I'll call you back about that in a second, if I you know the weather at Leesburg, expect RNAV 3 circle to 31. I already but checked the notams on this plate, so the notams do not apply, the notams do not apply to us right now. Looking at the RNAV GPS-3 to Leesburg, we're kind of probably expecting to be going to Punk U, uh, at or above 2000 to Punk U, then to Joxon, right turn, then it's down 1800 to Jurat, which is going to be our final approach fix. I'm Bravo Golf, clear direct to Punk U and join the RNAV for three. Clear direct Punk U, join the RNAV for three, 71 Bravo Golf. Alright, so we'll go to my flight plane, and we'll go down to Punk U, we'll go direct. Direct, activate, boom, right turn to 281. Bravo Golf, upon completion of your approach flight heading 030, I maintain 2000, departure frequency 135.3. Alright, upon completion of the approach, uh, fly heading 030, climb maintain 2000, departure 135.3, uh, 71 Bravo Golf. And he said to join the approach, we're not Remember clear. 71 approach. Bravo Golf, what are your requests after Leesburg? After Leesburg, we like to get uh, one ILS into Sanford and then an ILS to a full stop in Executive. 
we're three and a half from Punk U, that's good. We haven't been cleared for the approach, we've just been told to join the approach, so we're not descending yet. Punk U at above 2,000, then 1,800 Jurot. Then we're circling for this approach, so our minimums are gonna be 700. We would need one mile of visibility, which we should definitely have today. Uh, and our circling is to 3-1, so we're expecting to join kind of a left downwind to a left base to runway 3-1. And our missed approach we've already got, which is going to be 0 30, 2000, and, one, and departure 135-3. Cool. Yeah, that's one thing to watch out with students, because they're, they're, they're always heads down. Yeah. So they're always going off on stuff. You're not, because you're, you're, you're in the higher level, you know, the higher yeah. echelons. But, yeah, I'm, I'm really enjoying what you're doing, looking good, everything's looking fine. I. I I'd actually like better what Nick is doing. What? Uh, holding, uh, holding heading really well. Yeah. <laughs> Nick, you're doing a brilliant job. <laughs> that CDI is dead nailed in the center back there. Really, really good. Nice coordination in, uh, in all the tests. 71 Bravo Golf, cleared RNAV runway 3, circle 31. All right, cleared RNAV 3, circle 31, 71 Bravo Golf. November 246, Now we have 7.8 miles to get down. We might just make it. It's going to be a struggle. We're going to You'll do well. So this is a circling approach. So which approach category are we flying under? Uh, well, we're still under category A, and we're going to be circling at our 700. What radius around the airport would be guaranteed obstacle clearance well, at that altitude? This doesn't have the inverted C here. So we have 1.3, Okay. and uh, we'll say we're pretty much ready for the approach. This is kind of a lot of driving around this approach because it kind of <laughs> takes us out on a tour of the countryside, yeah. which I can't see. Yeah, we can't. But I hope you guys are really enjoying it. It's really it. nice, isn't it, Nick? I like the grass strip over here. <laughs> now what we're going to do is we're going to do our approach down, cancel, and then bail out to the grass strip. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Make Nick happy because he's landed on so many soft fields before. <laughs> he loves the soft fields. <laughs> Lewis, how many soft fields have you landed on? Just the one. Nick, how much 121 time have you got? The infamous Nick. Oh, boy. Oh, always commenting positive things in the comments. He is your number one fan. Though. He is. Kill. So we're going to go right to that 041. And as always, we just, we're just just following the magenta lines, actually. This is my main We're always line. following the magenta lines. Always. Just the magenta. Is <laughs> if you're not, you're doing it wrong. Yeah, we... So we did LP plus V, we have our advisory glide slope. Contact, executive tower nice. 118.7. Rene 1 Bravo Golf, radar service terminated. Keep your squawk code though. And contact Leesburg Tower 119.35. Uh, Leesburg Tower, Skyhawk 781 Bravo Golf is uh, 5 from Jurat. Uh, inbound on the RNAV 3, circle to 3 1. Skyhawk 781 Bravo Golf, Leesburg Tower, circle west for left base runway 3 1, report Jurat. So we'll get over here, and actually we could be down to 1800 here. Yeah. Alright, so we're right about our 1800, so we'll power that up. And we're two from our final approach fix, and so we have a, a little bit, it's like a six degree intercept, so that's bringing it back. Alright, one dot low, and I'm going to go ahead and report Jurat. And at least for Tower 71 Bravo Golf, uh, we're Jurat inbound. Cessna 1 Bravo Golf, Roger, report circling. Alright, report circling, uh, 1 Bravo Golf. All right, now we're going to be down to 700. Uh, we're crossing. Got that left downwind, three, one, got that power back. And we're, in the, we're two, below 110, so we can get that first three, notch one, collapse three, down one, there. Go for go three, one, now we're kind of two, using, five. keeping this really key part of our scan. And we're going to be looking to circle. Actually, I have my trusty co-pilot here who's going to tell me whether we have the field in sight. Okay. We're going to need to have the runway in, that the l runway we intend to land on in sight uh, for us to execute this circle. Let's say you commence the circle, yeah, and all of a sudden you, you're back in a cloud. Yeah, so we're going to turn towards our landing runway. So since we're making a left down and a left base, we're going to be turning left towards the center of the runway complex, then climbing up. Okay. Then once we are safely established in a climb, we're going to make our turnout instructions, which is going to be that zero, uh, I believe it was zero thirty. So we're a little fast, so we're going to pull that power back a little bit. And we're using our pitch and trim to kind of keep on glide slope of 1,000 for 700. We're coming back in. Uh, as soon as we get to 700, we're not going to go below minimums. Uh, we're going to probably stop the... ...750 for safety. We're kind of in and out of them at the moment. Yeah, I'm getting it, but then losing it. But... All right, it's in sight now. All right, you got it in sight? Got it in sight. All right, so we don't really necessarily need to go much lower than this then. So if we're out, if we're visible, we're going to power up a little bit here to kind of hold our, our speed and, and go level. And we'll go ahead and I'm going to go visible, okay. visual, and I'm going to report circling. 
Uh, Leesburg Tower 71 Bravo Golf, uh, now circling for 3 1. Cessna 1 Bravo Golf, runway 3 1, cleared for option. Cleared option 3 1 at 71 Bravo Golf. Alright, so uh, we're going to do a touch and go. Sounds good. Mike Trolls, I'm the steward. Alright, you're the steward. Right, but I kind of know what I'm doing at the moment. On a departure, Sky 71 Bravo Golf 030, climbing 1000 for 2000. Never miss 71 Bravo Golf, land a departure, I dent, expect ILS from a 27 right at Sanford. So you can brief it for me a while I yeah, fly. Yeah, let me, well first let's, let me just go ahead and get it set up. Yep. So we'll go ahead and plug this in here, 27 right. Alrighty, uh, and let me go ahead and get the ATIS and I'm um, Keep, keep an eye on what you're doing. One, two, five, nine, seven, five. Oh no, we don't do that. Oh, no, we don't want to do that. Remember, remember, just like VFR, where we want to not skid and slip. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> like plan. We have a little bit of flying to do. So procedure approach ILS. Oh, we probably don't want to. <laughs> We're having a little button, aren't we? <laughs> just trying to make Nick sick. That's all I'm trying to do. <laughs> it definitely is worse in the back seat, I'm sure. <laughs> Looking at the ILS. 27 right, Orlando, Stanford. Uh, we have 11,000 foot runway, so we should have enough. Touchdown zone 45, airport of village 55. Echo, Notes do not apply. Traffic, Notes do not apply. Right. Make sure you, you focus on the flying while oh. I'll, I'll brief, I'll just read it out to us. Okay, okay. In fact, right. you know what we'll do? Keep, keep, keep from being heads, heads down, we'll bring it out here, right? Oh. Okay. To kind of make it a little easier. Let's come back to our approach plate. Again, we're looking at the right thing. Charts current. Notes don't apply, we like to say. We have everything configured, right? Three is already done, so we're not distracting ourselves here. So we're coming in kind of like a right downwind, right base for this. So we're kind of out here somewhere. So we're going to be expecting some kind of right turn, right turn, right turn to get on there. We need to be at or above uh, 1600 the whole time. He's got us up to 3000, so he's going to give us some descent. So at or above 1600 at Uxfim, if he brings us all the way out there. Uh, at or above 1600 at Belfo, so we'll see. Uh, final approach fix, 1600 feet. Gonna be Udemy and straight in ILS 27 right. Uh, the minimums are gonna be 245 and a half a mile, which is 200 AGL. So 245 and a half is the minimums. I got the radials from now. All right. So like a any anything that I do that you see is you know is, right. isn't right. It, it could be anything. Okay. All right. Have you figured out what you're gonna do yet? No. Okay. <laughs> Just let it, let it, let it come. Yeah, just let it up and just let my natural tendencies come out. <laughs> <laughs> just channel your inner uh, instrument student. Exactly. Oh boy. There you go. Come on. Uh, All right. We'll pretend that you at least have a private pilot's license. Yeah. Maybe. Well, <laughs> for yeah. doing ILS. I, was, I want to do instrument first. <laughs> you know? Now, now, dear student, do we know when we would have to fly that holding pattern that's right. there? So picked it there. Um. I can tell you maybe some things when we wouldn't do Sure, it. yeah, when wouldn't we do it? Uh, straight in approach. Right. Uh, like if he, if he said straight in, right? If he says straight in, uh -huh. yeah. Uh, if you're doing holding in lieu of the procedure turn. Uh -huh. If you're flying to your alternate, you don't need to fly the procedure turn. Your alternate? Yeah. I don't know about that. No, I thought I read that. So what about if we're getting radar vector? Oh, yeah, then you definitely don't need yeah, it. Yeah, okay, you don't need yeah. it. <laughs> Trying to act stupid, yeah. man. <laughs> Making myself a aircraft. Metro one Bravo Golf, descend to maintain 2,000. 2,000, one Bravo Golf. So there's your there's your altitude. So we're going to be ready to put in uh, put in some power a little bit in advance of where you want to level off at. There you go. Well, not quite that much. Legion 2106, descend to maintain 4,000. Oh, get that 4, nose down 000. a little bit. 2106. Make small power change there. Oh. And uh, when we look at this attitude, I want to keep, kind of probably keep within plus or minus five degrees of pitch most of the time. And so if you're still descending, you maybe put a little more power just to touch. Not a lot, a lot, maybe 50 RPM or something. And then we'll just use our trim at this point to hold, hold level here, right? We don't want to 
Okay. Sorry, I'm just nervous. That's okay. Make sure you can trim so your hand's off, right? If you let go, what is going to happen? Yeah, it seems pretty all right. Now, can you tell me what you're looking at here? Which instruments are you focusing on? I'm just on that one. Now, we want to <laughs> we want to we want to bounce around a little bit. So we're going to use a radial scan, right? So we're going to look at this one. Then we're going to look at our heading. We're going to come back here. Then we're going to look at our altitude. Two back thousand. here, look at our altitude. Two thousand. Okay. Number seventy one Bravo Golf. Summer heading 140. 140 Bravo. Cessna 71 Bravo Golf. Turn right heading 180. 180 Bravo Golf. Yeah, yeah, that, uh, a little, not quite as much, uh, not quite as much on the controls there. So just, yeah, nice, smooth. Because I'm trying to chase it. No, don't, don't chase it. Kind of make a, make a move. Wait for a result. Make a move. You know, wait for a result. Okay. I'll, I'll do my best to bring that into the ILS. Yeah, we gotta. <laughs> <laughs> I think this, this is going to be a semi-remedial chain. It's going to be a second opinion from another instructor. <laughs> this is going to be an amazing glide slope, I can tell. Yeah, yeah. RMS 71 Bravo Golf, turn right hitting 270, intercept 27 right localizer. Uh, two, uh, three. All right, All right we'll turn right 270, intercept the 27 right localizer, uh, 71 Bravo Golf. I was like, no, 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 that's, <laughs> no, no, no. The guy's I was like, like I wait, know that's Lou Dix. What's wrong? With that? <laughs> I know that's the thing. My reputation is going down the. <laughs> sh <laughs> I was like, when is he gonna mess with me on the radio? <laughs> yeah. All right, so we're out. the center to below localizer. We're not clear for the approach yet. So we cannot descend. Okay. okay. All right, no, we don't want to turn past. We're turning to 270. Whoa, no, no, gentle, gentle turn, gentle turns. All right, let's turn back. All right, we're on the localizer, so that's fine. Uh, I'm just gonna hold west. Now what? Two thousand until you establish unlocalizer, but ILS for me two seven right approach. Two thousand until establish clear for the uh, ILS two seven right. Uh, one Bravo. Nearly set civil links. Oh, now you're not really gonna <laughs> shave yourself. <laughs> All right, so we're getting off localizer here, so we need to turn right a little because we're yeah. We, okay. We need a little wind correction. Remember the wind was coming that way. Of course, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah so yeah. Let, let's let's turn maybe like that much more over here, right? Let's, let's just pick a heading in bracket and see how it works, right? Okay. So we can cheat, use our GPS and see our track is greater than our. DTK, okay. so we should be coming to the right. And it's coming in. Right, so now, now we're going to turn back a few degrees there. Okay. All right, let's, 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 let's stay on that heading. Let's try to focus on this. And at this point, we're coming back and forth between this and this. You know, we're, we're looking at all our instruments here, and we're still 2,000. And we're clear for the approach, so we can actually get down to 1,600. So let's get down. Pull the power back. There we go. Near miss, 71 Bravo Golf. Contact San Retire, 120.3. See you on the miss. One, two, zero point three. See on this. It's one Bravo. Epic Air. I was like, is he gonna mess with me? Summit Tower Skyhawk seven eight one Bravo Golf just outside Unity ILS two seven right. All right, and we're gonna hold sixteen hundred here. Stanford Tower wind. Yeah, there you uh, go. Variable right now zero five zero at four runway two seven right. Clear for the option. But uh, clear for the option two seven right. It's one Bravo. All right, pull back. Yeah, so we're gonna be right at that sixteen hundred. We're one dot low, so let's go ahead and and reduce the power a little bit. And we're gonna we're below 110, so we can put in that first notch of flaps. That's good. Now come back to your instruments. Don't wait on that. Oh, yeah. That's okay. It's okay. Now we're looking for about 450 foot per minute descent here, so we want to maintain about 85 knots, right? So nice, nice loose grip on it, right? Don't. Yeah. No, just keep the focus. All right, this which 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 instruments are you looking at? Just this one. No, no, no. We we need to also look at this, right? We need to include this in your scan as well. And oh. so we're a little bit low, so we're going we're gonna to control the glide slope with our pitch and our trim. And if we get lower than 85, we're going to add a little bit of power. Okay, so I need a little bit of power. Yeah, just a little bit. Not, yeah. not much, just a little. And then, uh, yeah, so if, if, we, if this is going to the left, we need to fly a little bit left, right? Okay. So it's coming off to the left, so we want to be left of that heading bug, right? A little left of that. Yeah, more heading. Yeah, not quite that steep. Not quite that, not that quite steep. My controls, my controls. Yeah, controls. My controls. All right. All right, so let's get let's get you settled down here, and I'll turn it back over to you. Oh, you're, you're doing fine, you're doing fine. We'll just get it, we'll just get it settled down. I don't down. think you're cut out for this. <laughs> I really don't think so either. All right, no, you're doing fine. You're doing fine. So just relax. All right, so we we've got him back in the donut, right? We've got our power basically set where we want it. We're kind of re-intercepting our glides or re-intercepting our localizer. We're still a little high, so I'm gonna pull back a little because we're fast. And okay. you can your controls again. My controls and. Just try to kind of keep it kind of where it's at. So just focus on that heading, 
and, f and come over to here, look at the attitude indicator. So if we're turning, we're not doing the right thing, right? We don't normally want to just be turning because we're going straight and we're going down. One, three, four, we're a little turn, high, one, three, six, clear so wind, pitch, wind, three, six, pitch down zero, a little bit, six. yeah. And if we get a little fast, we can pull one, a little three, power three, out. Six, uh, we don't want to mess with the power too much. Yeah. And we're looking for a minimum of 245. 245, yeah, so we're 900 for 245. Yeah, we're looking okay right now, we're a little high, that's okay, but our descent is above our 450 that we're looking for, so that means we're intercepting it here. Yeah. 800 for 245. Yeah. parking. Thank you. Above it. Oh, no, no, we don't, no. We, don't we don't want to do anything. We want a nice, smooth, nice smooth, I felt the belt on that one. Uh, Brilliant, brilliant. Okay, this is looking all right. We're just still a little high, so we just need to pull a little power and, and get down. There you go. And now we're gonna kind of going down pretty quickly, so we need to be adding power once we get re-intercepting that glide up. Not quite that much. Let's keep it at like 16. That was working for us, right? Okay. okay. Yeah, 16 was looking good. Skyhawk, four mile, right. center, two mile final, runway three six, wind. Just three less six bank, zero, right? Like five. make smaller corrections down here, right? We're, we're, we're real close. We're real close. We're a little low. 400 for 245. Yeah, so, whoa, no, let's 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 stay coordinated on those rudders. It's getting so much I, That's okay, it's a little real sensitive, but my controls are on. Yeah, controls. Here, let, just watch how I how I kind of re-intercept this. All right. Right, so we're a little fast, so I'm pulling power. I'm making nice, smooth adjustments. You know, once it's moving quickly, we need to make kind of a little bit more of an adjustment to get it. And now we're at, we're past our minimums, and my controls. Do, your controls, you want to do touch and go? Yeah, let's do it. All right, cool. Oh, we might have enough runway to get this Cessna down. Possibly. Full flaps. There we come. It's a lot heavier on the left side, that makes sense. That was nice. That was, that was good. Yeah. <laughs>